Vanity's bowling. This is unbelievable. Bring on the part-time bowlers more often. Somehow he's got through. Don't have a look at the celebration. I think the Indians know things were getting desperate out there. Ganguly got to go. First ball, he's nailed Mark Wall. A little easier. Not over yet, though. What a performance, a little bit of in-swing. Bevan's gone, and it's 6 for 195 and 30 off 24. He's risen to the occasion in the test matches, and now the one day as a skipper. That's well bowled. Ganguly is so desperate to get his young troops over this line. He's bowled tight the whole over. He's bowled straight and a good length, not half volley. And not too short, that one on the perfect length with a little bit of off-cut. Leg cut to the left-hander. Thank you. Six for 195. Yeah. That will be consternation in the Pakistan dressing room. And Surya Ganguly has done the trick. Seven for 120. It's an exciting game of cricket. Low scoring. But Ganguly has broken through and he's picked the wicket of the Pakistan Cup. Well, Vader came onto the field, but obviously working for the Indians. He's taken Ozzy Macram's concentration. The Indian fans are delighted. Ozzy Macram, the Pakistani captain, departs. So Rev Ganguly knocks him over. Seven for 120. Nick and got him. Got him. Court slip. Beautifully done. Well, that was well pitched up. And once again, Ganguly's into the uh, action here. You better not uh, nick it to him because uh, he's decided he's going to do everything he possibly can to make it tough for Pakistan. What's the bet he gets 100 as well? We can do no wrong. So Rev Ganguly. Wide one to Johanna. Threw the kitchen sink at it, but only got an edge to it. Went straight to Rahul Dravid at first slip. So Ganguly making runs, taking wickets, taking catches as well. He's having a good game and a good summer. Johanna departs. Caught at first slip by Rahul Dravid. There's a cricket ground as well. It should be out. Ganguly's got it. Now Gan Ganguly. I think he's uh, had quite a bit of a hand in uh, some of the planning of uh, today's efforts. Perhaps uh, not all the planning was as he'd said it should be, but he seems to be making a point of letting them know that uh, he's the man who should be on, and he's getting the wickets. He's got three of them now. Moenkar mistimed it. Normally hits them long. Maybe the extra pace, the extra bounce of Perth made him top edge it. 23 from 30. Six for two out A little bit too late. It's got him. Brilliant stuff from Sarah Gungurley. No shot offered by Jacques Callas. It's cannon into that off stump. He's into the attack, the skipper. And they're in a frenzy now at Eden Gardens. They sure are. And uh, good work from the skipper to bring himself on. A change of pace, a change of angle. He's got the two left arm quicks, but he comes in from the other side. Two very close LV shouts the previous over. An outside edge. And now this one. Just hitting the bales. And Callis not offering a stroke. Certainly what India required at this stage. <laughs> it is a god. Another test wicket to me. Thank you very much. And the important thing is to keep the shine on the other side, which is exactly what Saru Ganguly is doing. So about 20 to 25 overs. Yeah! It's got it. There it is. Terrific stuff from Saru Ganguly. He struck this morning inside the first half hour. He has bowled beautifully, and he certainly deserved that wicket. And a great breakthrough for India. The captain strikes, and that's exactly what they wanted. A wicket early in the session. It's taken them half an hour, but it's still come good. Just 11 runs scored this morning, and the Indians will get into the huddle again. The length was very, very good indeed. Drawing the batsman onto the front foot. Had to play at the delivery, Bodha Dipana, and Dinesh Karthik does the rest. 
He is a happy chappy. And why not? The Indian captain celebrates. And time for everybody to join in. Dipana has played a very good hand, contributed to this good partnership. He's gone for 48. It's 241 for five. That's a big hit. He could be out. He's under it. He's gone. What a wicket. The last ball for Ganguly. Clark holds out. 15 off 12. Two wickets in the hutch. What a match. This is the World Cup final. This is magnificent bowling by Ganguly. He's gone through the whole gambit of emotions in this over. He's tugged at his hair. He's had the hands on the head plenty of times. And now he's got hands outstretched. Great length. Sees Clark coming. Puts it on a good length. Clark has to play a brilliant shot and falls just short. Caught by Badani at long on. The latest emotion is joy. Not for Clark. Eight for 210. And Gurley to continue. Edged, and Taylor is gone. Ganguly has got the breakthrough after beating Taylor many times outside off stump. Well, there's the celebrations. This is how it happened. Mark Taylor fishing outside off stump. This time he does nick it. Easy catch to the keeper. Looks behind. Very disappointed. And again, another wicket down for Australia. Fourth wicket to fall, 29 runs on the board. Taylor's on his way for three. 21 deliveries, and probably half of them he played a missed at. Finally, he did get the edge. And the score, 29. Tommy whips the square. He's out! Straight down the throat of a Gurkha. Well, game on here, five for 176. Big wicket for the captain. Good catch at Gurga. Simons has gone for 16. Well, what a sequence of three deliveries. Play and miss. A big appeal by the wicketkeeper and fielders. A flat batted six over straightish cover. And then a really powerfully flicked ball onto the leg side. Straight to the man who takes a good catch. The Indians are huddled firmly at mid-wicket. Simons on his way. Five for 176. Oh, there's a man at the cover point. Pasadi should get this. He's coming around. Yes, he does. Greedy for once goes over the top and finds the fieldsman. He departs for 41. That's a big wicket for the Indians. They needed that. And who he's got? Greedy. Some joy for the Indian supporters. We've got that, uh, I suppose, a bit off the middle of the bat, mainly off the thick edge. It was a real charge. He's trying to hit it away over cover. too difficult about the catch, but uh, if you're low on confidence, anything can happen. Gay Gooley says, I should have been on earlier. 3 for 133. That's it! Oh, he's got him. He's hit it straight to cover. He's done it again, Gunguli. He's come in. He looks a little innocuous. Slate has gone after him, and he's hit it straight to cover. Well, what a move this is. The Indians have got another wicket here, and they've got off to a very good start in the series. And he's out. Magnificent catch that by the Indian captain. He had to run a fair distance. The ball lobbed up in the air all right. But these are very difficult to judge. Short delivery from Saro Ganguly. Yes, Kaspovic was caught by surprise there. He wasn't expecting the bouncer. That is a very good catch from uh, Azaruddin. Kept his eye on the ball all the way. He really is a magnificent fielder. 98 catches, 98 catches for Azaruddin. And it's 232 for nine. Umpire Parthasarthi has given a walking decision Australia all out Saurav Ganguly the local boy the Prince of Calcutta has picked his third wicket well that'll send the patrons home happy Australia losing their final wicket with the last ball it goes to the uh, local hero looked like it may have just been sliding down leg side 
But uh, Robertson is gone, and Australia have been bowled out. Saurav Ganguly decided to make it his own. That's straight into his lap. Slow ball from Ganguly. He's used it well. In the air, another wicket here. Arsene Raza. That's in the air. The man is under it. He's searching for it, and he gets it. In the air. Straight in, batsman can't believe it. The bowler doesn't mind at all. Wicket number four for Saurav Ganguly. Goodbye, Moin Khan. Down the ground, into the fielder's lap. He enjoys that place. Ideally suited. Batting has to work hard, uh, but uh, getting wickets in those conditions easy for him. His kind of seam bowling is ideally suited. The weather helps him, the wicket helps him, it seems the whole day, so whether you're bowling first or bowling second doesn't matter. He, he comes in, he puts the ball on the seam at the right spot, and uh, the rest is done by the wicket. India demolished Pakistan in the first three games of the five-match series. Ganguly's bat hadn't quite blazed, although he had made a contribution in low-scoring matches. But with the ball, he was deadly. After the first year's uh, beating, I think uh, they went there a little more charged up and uh, wanting to really, you know, put things back uh, in balance. And um, Saurav Ganguly leading from the front, you know, by his performances and against an opposition that was looking to just dominate the whole Sahara episode. I think it was a good comeback and it was especially pleasing for Ganguly to be able to play a big role in that. The reaction said it all. India had taken revenge for the 3-2 loss at Toronto a year ago to the old enemy. Saurav Ganguly had shown the way with Man of the Match awards in two of the first three matches. But there is never a quarter given, nor one asked for, in an India-Pakistan clash. So there was little doubt that the two matches to go would be just as competitive.